exactly. Martin Kenny, your policy, just to get it right, I think of Sinn Féin, is it to get, if you got into power, water charges would go and property tax would go, is that That's correct? That's correct, yes. Where would you get the billions to make up the shortfall of the money for the Exchequer? Well, first of all, you know, we have always costed our budgets for every year that we have, we've costed the budgets, and next week we produce in our pre-budget documents, which will be fully costed, and we'll say, show exactly where the money will come from, as we have every year in regard to all of this. You know, the issue of, of boiled water in Roscommon but is an issue tonight, going back Martin, many, many years. To tell the people tonight, though, many, where many, that money for, come for from. Many, for many years, we have had this. this. We're in the parish of Donnybrook here tonight. You know, if this parish was boiling the water for the last 10 years, do you think it would happen? Not a chance. It is a reflection of how Fianna Fáil and Fine Gael have totally failed the constituency of Roscommon and South Leitrim. And that's the big issue and what people realise must happen is that okay. they, cannot, they cannot afford to pay these continued water bills, property taxes, etc. Okay. And we're talking about an economy turning around. It is not turning around. There are no jobs. I, I would challenge Maura to okay, tell me, me where stick, the jobs are Let in me just Roscommon stick for one moment, Martin, on that point, though. It's a very popular position to take that water charges will go and property tax will go. People go, yes. alleluia. But what I want to know is, give me an idea where the billions would come from. Well, we, as, as I said, we have, we have already costed all of this in our pre-budget submissions in other years. For instance, we're talking about uh, an increase of 48% uh, of people who earn over €100,000 per annum. We're talking about increases in taxes on, on betting, on various other things. I'm not going to go through all of them here tonight, but we have costed it. It's there. The media and everybody else has seen it, and we can stand over it. But it's multi-billions you're going to, have to, going to have to raise, Martin. Do we, we already have a water service in Ireland. The problem is that we haven't got investment in it. 70% of water in most areas is leaking into the ground. But that'll cost they, they you more money again. They need to be fixed. That's, that's a stimulus package which will create jobs and which will create employment in local areas and bring, put money into people's pockets so they can spend in the towns in rural Ireland. That's what we need to see happen. Not money being spent millions and hundreds of millions on consultants. That's, that's the problem okay, we have. More, come back Irish in water, there and then I'll bring the rest of Irish Water Merriam is another example of jobs for the boys. More. They're well connected and looked after again. What I would say is that I... I believe that it is a good idea to tax people earning 100,000 or more at a rate of 48% uh, percent in the pound or in the euro. And I can cast my mind back to 1980 when I took up my first job. I was paying 56% tax in the pound and I wasn't earning uh, a high wage. Will we open the A in e No, I said we will not make a promise, but we have, we're have. we not ruling it in, we're not ruling it out. People in Roscommon... People in Roscommon... No, people in Roscommon are sick of false promises. Inda Kinney came down in 2011 and made a false promise to the people in the square in Roscommon okay. Town. In office, three months later, he turned on okay, that. Okay, let me be fair, Ivan. Martin, you come back in. So, me, sorry. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, look, Sinn Féin's position on this is clear, and every party has been asked to state their position. If we were in government, we would reopen the accident emergency in Roscommon Hospital and protect the service in Port Yonkla Hospital. Hospital services, and it's, it's the whole issue of, of medical cards, all these health issues are vital to people's lives, and they need to be put paramount and front of house in all of this. I mean, Ivan is here tonight and he's saying, you know, that basically when you read through what he said, he said he is not no, going no, to not, open the act no, of nerve. That's, that's what you've said. That's what you've said. I did not. I let him in, just let him in. That's what you've no, said. Well, he didn't say I want to be part of a strong Sinn Féin team, team in the Dáil with, with Gerry Adams, with Pierce Doherty, Mary Lou Macdonald to fight for people's services on the ground. And when I get there, that's what I'll do. And there will not be waffle Sorry, like what we're hearing from men. Okay, that's, Martin, I just want to hear one, Ivan, check one point, though. But Sinn Féin, like, it is a very popular stance with that's respect to do that. All I'm saying is, are you sure that all the consultants who recommended that the A and E should be closed that's and was sent into bigger well, offices, well, they're all wrong? That's an interesting that's point. That's an interesting okay, point, Marion, because it's, it's actually a false point. I think Leo Varadkar said the other day when they talked about reopening the hospital, he, the accident emergency, he said, "Where is the money yeah, going to come from?" Them. When they closed it down, money had nothing got to do with it. They said that Hikwa wanted it closed, and there was safety issues. They keep moving the goalposts. The reality is, it is not going to cost a fortune for to provide hospital and emergency services in Roscommon Hospital. Okay, I need Martin Kenny in here. The, the, the truth is that for many years, the beef barons, the tycoons, yeah. all the guys, they're all in the same yeah. pot, along with Fianna Fáil and Fine Gael. Where did they get the, the brown bags and the, and good, the brown envelopes from? They're the guys that got them from. That's why we're in this mess. They don't look after the farmers, they look after the processors, they look after big business. And they look after Sa themselves. The, yeah. same th the same thing, whether it was Fianna Fáil or Fine Gael that were in government, this election is a choice between the politics of the past, the politics of Fianna Fáil and Fine Gael, or a new and different way forward. And I represent that way Mary forward. Emmett and then Michael. Emmett.